Bob's Burgers reaction. Well, Bob's Burgers reaction. Well, it's season nine, episode three and four. The tweet, the tween chabineurs. Okay, that was fucking hard to say. And Nightmare on Ocean Avenue Street. Okay, with the first one, I don't exactly know what to expect, but it's, it's obviously like a play on words of entrepreneur. I'm guessing maybe Jean Louise, because it says tween, which I'm pretty sure that's like from the age of like 10 to 12? I don't know. So maybe them? I, I really don't know. So I don't know, maybe they try to become entrepreneurs. But with the Nightmare on Ocean Avenue Street, I'm guessing that's obviously going to be the Halloween episode, which I'm excited for. But I'm guessing the title's also like a parody of Nightmare on Elm Street. Is that what it's called? I don't know. I don't watch horror movies, so I've never actually seen it, so I can't remember what it's called. But besides that, I really don't know what to expect from these episodes, so let's just get into it. Calculator? Check. Hell yes. Casual, bro. What is this for? Check. Um, I mean, I'm guessing maps or school. Jean, look. Stop it, <laughs> brother's not a cat. Apparently he is. I'm, I'm done. Tina, what's with all the business stuff? Today's the first day of tween entrepreneurs. The oh. Have small business class. Okay, so it's a class at the school. Oh, yeah, okay, that makes sense. Babies. Kids form an actual startup to design, make, and sell our own new product. Okay, okay well, she. Tina being the muskiest. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Elon Musk. I, I do not like him. I'm just gonna. That's all I'm gonna say. Entrepreneurship is no walk in the park. One day. Wait, is this it, the only people that's in this class? That's actually kind of surprising. The next, a PBS lawyer sends you a cease and desist letter that practically threatens to break your fingers. Okay. PBS will get you, boy. Don't poke that hornet's nest. Now you will all present ideas and choose one for production. And don't. I mean, we did shit like this at school. Like it was basically just market day. But um, you didn't get to keep the money or anything. I mean, that's pretty obvious. Like, it was fundraising for the school. But you had to come up with your own store and sell shit. Listen, but you don't want to attract looks. Solution? Inhaler hider. <laughs> <laughs> that's just a fucking... No one will you, know. Yeah. It's a clown nose for horses. Why should they yeah, miss out on Yeah, because I'm sure there's a massive they market for that. around and I was bored. Lonely? No, more bored. <laughs> no. Anyway, I saw a chunk of wood and I thought, hey, that's almost as good, so... I made woodchuck. That wood has okay. eyes, I love- Oh, it's basically like those pet rock things. Looks like woodchucks it is! Okay like, then, that well, you set up your company, that, at least it's easy to make. In charge, not me. So like always. Huh. Jimmy Jr. should be president because he did invent woodchuck. I, I mean, fair enough. president of sales because people literally cannot say no to me. Let sure. me try. Mm. Okay, I guess people can't actually say no, okay. Doesn't somebody have to make them? Oh, yeah, you gotta saw the wood, sand it, stain it, stick on the googly eyes. Oh, but yeah, it's pretty right. easy. Ew. So you and you and you and you can do that. Whoa, okay, then. Whoa, whoa. Job well done. I mean, my job. You guys are just getting started. Yep, sure. Hey, there's a plate we don't need to wash. <laughs> I mean, we will. We are Has that guy been in another episode? Why does he look familiar to me? Oh, thank you. Here you go. No rush. Uh, excuse me. Did you say no rush? Yeah, whenever you're ready, hon. Well, then I guess that would be... Yeah. Never! Oh, my God. A fucking course. Jesus oh Christ. How big a check? 750 plus tip. He liked me. There would have been a tip. That's okay. God. Never mind. I'm going to get him. Go! Are you going to, though? I don't think you can. He got away. It all happened so fast. It happened kind of fast. Well, I should have caught him. I mean, to be fair, though, he did have a massive ass head start. <laughs> wow, that sawdust really travels back into the old Oh, God, yeah, system, sawdust. But... Wait, <laughs> fucking something. See them breathing. Yeah, in. sawdust with a stain chaser. At least there's no ventilation. This job stinks. I mean, yeah, it, it kind of does, though. So. When they literally don't even have to do fucking anything. Turn these chucks into bucks. Sales. The real work. Oh, and I guess they are the Big ones, one. you know, you. outside selling them, I guess. Take our money. You and okay, I are great at this. I know. Wood chucks making bucks. Wood okay, oh. Fucking sawdust, though. Like, I, I, when, I had to, when I did woodwork and that at school, I'm pretty sure we had to wear, like, a mask thing. That's the one that they had not. Hey, are there any band-aids over here? Oh, um, is something going on? We celebrated all our sales by investing our profits in a soda spurt thingy. Okay, then. That's a fucking waste of money. What's with these cubicles? Yeah, what? We literally what? boxed us in back there. We tried the open floor plan. It just wasn't working. Okay, we then, sure. Us in our soda. Okay, it just feels like you're creating a division. Yeah, it's, this, let's be real, though. This is, like, fucking most businesses, say where the executives do jack shit while the people, like, making them other ones actually keeping this business going it seems like the sanders and stainers are doing all the freaking work while management sits on their damn butt yes oh, oh, oh. language I mean, I, FW, girl. like literally but tabby and jocelyn are doing like a tiny bit by actually selling them but like all the belgian children plus rudy are doing all the fucking work 
Let's take a walk. You are raising some amazing points. I hope someone's writing them down. I wrote them down. Oopsies, well, there that went. So maybe you could keep all your smarty ideas going as our new Sander and Stainer relations manager. Okay, then okay. sure. Mm -hmm. You'd be in here. This is kind of nice. Okay, Jesus is actually going to work and then Jane, Louise, and Rudy are going to be doing fucking everything. And my scotch tape. And you know, this cat calendar is mine, but I think I'm going to leave it. Ugh. You're one of them now, Tina. Yes, you really are. And not a fun frisky suit like something Ellen would wear. Guys, this is a good thing. I'm gonna be your eyes and ears over there, looking out. Oh, you don't. Like, weren't you one? Like, I, I wouldn't be that surprised if you just turned into them. Five minutes? So, good talk. I'm gonna let you guys get crack a lacking. I was ready to be annoyed, but that finger thing was cool. <laughs> okay. I don't know if I can go any faster. Yeah, come on. My body is already breaking down. Well, there's only one thing to do. Quit. Oh, I mean, yeah, fair enough. No, that still sounds like a lot of ass. So <laughs> quarter ass it is. Gonna throw just a little bit of my chicken. <laughs> I love that. If they complain about it being shit, I'm gonna. They can literally just be like, yeah, you made us do it in five minutes, so. Hey guys, how was your day? How's Twin Entrepreneurs? I don't want to talk about it. Great, we're pushing a lot of units, making bank. Yeah. How's Bob's Burgers? Um, yeah, they're literally doing fucking it. nothing. Besides Jane, Louise, and Rudy. How are you Jane, making bank? Tina, you're, you're not making sense right now. I know, so businessy. Let's yeah. go, Jean. It smells like entrepreneur in here. That was me, but also, yeah. Okay, Dad, you didn't ask, but here are five. Okay. <laughs> she thinks she's a fucking business person now, like Jesus. Do you think she'd do our taxes? <laughs> hey, that customer in the booth over there, isn't that our Dinah Dasher? Oh my fucking god, it looks like it. Um, yeah, he doesn't look much like Oh my god. Edge. Yes, I mean, the two circles and the well, fucking, could put on you know, nose shape that just that looks, looks like a penis. It's, it's not that hard. This guy, he thinks he looks good in any hat. Anyway, <laughs> we can't just accuse him if we don't know for sure. That's true. Uh, why don't you go over there and feel him out a little? Be At least block block the door this time, just in case. We had a Dinah Dasher the other day, and you look a little bit like him. The guy had a hat? And everything? No. No. Oh, well, I can see why you'd be concerned. But if it was me, I would have to be crazy to come back, right? I mean, I mean yeah, he uh, fucking totally would, to be crazy. fair. But it probably is. <laughs> I'm sorry. Someone come and block the door, someone. Like, that would prevent it. All owls look the same to me. Those big eyes. Oh, <laughs> uh, sure. You know, it's fine. Oh, hope you enjoyed your meal. Here's your check. And it's he's about to run. A <laughs> fucking course. Damn it! Hi, guys. Just popping in. We couldn't finish these next door, so naturally. I thought of you. Oh, really, Tina? Yeah, fucking thank you for this <gasps> generous so gift. Much. <laughs> it's raising something or other. It's not good. Anyway, we've had a ton of complaints about splinters, so... I'm doing my best. Any... Yeah, Rudy looks like he's fucking half dead. Kind of Rudy, what's it going to take to get more work out of you guys? Um, carrot, get some help, stick. other people to come, and sticks. let them do it, you know, in day. 20 I'm minutes rather than fucking dizzy. five. Pull your shirt over your mouth and keep going, Rudy. <gasps> okay, yeah. then, jeez. Tina, you are this close to a walkout. Yeah, except walking also sounds like too much. Yeah, come on, fucking, yeah. you know, go on a strike. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, she did. Why is that what you're saying? I'm fine. Oh my That's god, it. okay. We're out. We're yeah. on strike. Wait, what? Hey, we, we, we can work this out. I, I think I can get you guys uh, soda spurt privileges. Yep, yeah, sure. Like, that's gonna help in the situation. We need product. So we turn the page to Woodchuck 2. Okay. Well, a mini one. one. A smaller package we don't even sand. I've been working on it in secret. I mean, it only took a minute. So it's <laughs> not okay. Woodchuck? More like wood yuck. Doesn't matter. It's new. We say it's cool. I mean, Best to be fair, though, for half price. it's like, you know, when Coke released a new fucking Coke and just called it new Coke. Oh my god, yeah, no uh, one's in it. Should Tristan. we have called it Woodchuck Gold Series? In what? Oh, I want that. Mr. Frond, hypothetically, what would happen if the tween entrepreneurs had a really big googly eye bill they couldn't pay? You'd be bankrupt, which happens. No shame. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> that's not so bad. You'd also get an F and oh my god, okay. Placed on your permanent record. Jesus. Oh. And you're not. A that's kind of fucked though to have that on a permanent record for something that happened when you were in middle school. Darn it, Tina! It's your fault we're flunking. Now we'll never get into the Ivan League. Okay, okay. Got a little distracted. I mean, yeah. If you, I don't understand why they can't just what? fucking, Edith you know, do when you tell make the original really ones themselves. I heard Edith put a knitting needle through a man's hand just because he didn't have exact change. <laughs> well, maybe Jesus. they'll be super cool about it. Yeah, I wouldn't count on that. 
Okay, what the fuck? The fact that she's there watching is a little bit insane. It's not our fault we got double dined and dashed. I mean, it's like fool me and you can't, you could have prevented it though. Guess who the shame is now? Still you. I don't think that's how it goes. Hi there. Oh my god. Okay, it's the guy. I'm going around the neighborhood as a courtesy. My identical twin brother has. Oh my fucking god. Sure. Your identical twin brother. Oh, yes, Gary. He's a bad seed, and he makes life very difficult for me. Okay, I'm, ve I'm very fucking intrigued. Are. Oh, it sounds like he's been here already. He was. You were. We're not buying your evil twin brother. <laughs> yes. If that's the truth, then that's actually kind of fucking insane. Okay, just give me uh, nine back from that 20. Uh, uh, nine right. from 20. And seven, eight, nine, and we're good. Wait, I think we did that backwards. Uh. I, I I thought something. Like okay, that. is he gonna that fucking scam me for a third time? Sorry, you have my twenty. I have your nine. <laughs> You're not trying to scam me, are you? No, no. <laughs> no okay, wait, not. Um, so He's one hundred percent gonna take the fucking twenty. Seven tip makes nine. His twenty my my not damn it. <laughs> <He> <laughs> I'm fucking with 20, you he left with twenty, Lynn. He got a free okay, meal. Okay, oh. Jesus Both Christ. Twins are evil. They're poor mothers. Oh my god, it's obviously no, not no, twins. We've opened up this emergency meeting to everyone, even the kids from the other side of the cardboard. Yes. That's probably a nicer way of saying. <laughs> Yes, and not, you know, the kids. Louise, you want to kick things off with a perfect idea? Uh-uh. You guys created this mess, not us. I will, however, bless this mess. You'll never unload these things. You might as well try to sell the whole stupid company. Yes, that's it. Unload the whole company and some unsuspecting fool. <laughs> well, okay, of course. Ah, uh, but who? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, who is... Oh, my God. Is it going to be Mr. fucking Frog? Uh -huh. No, I did it again. So oh, okay, Teddy. Oh, don't alert. put I fucking Teddy in this situation. Like, is this even a real company, technically? By the way, we're not telling my mom and dad about you investing. That raises red flags. Like, <laughs> yes, a lot. But I'm going to quash that feeling so I okay. don't miss out. Okay, sure. Let's do it. Ah, Tina, there you are. So you weren't going out to look at the foliage. Teddy, don't invest. The company's a stinker. Yeah, try to fucking, you know, scam Teddy out of in this. Waste money to make money. Teddy. Okay, then. You're Bob's kid. And if your company is anything like Bob's Burgers, I know I'm getting in on something special. Yeah, you're so really not, though. Uh, I think that's the sound of your soul leaving your body. Yes, or the guilt, I'm guessing, maybe. I was conning you. I'm a business monster. Wow, I don't know what to say. Except that kind of honesty, I've never believed in you more than right now. <laughs> okay. Money back, damn it. I'm just gonna give you more. Oh, my God, Teddy. Just fucking keep the money. Gene, I, I think you sat on some googly eyes. That's okay. I'm used to eyes on my butt. Okay, then. Oh, my God. Guys, we never should have made woodchucks in the first place. We should have made coodchucks. Wait, what? Woodchucks. Yeah, I'm not th I don't. I'm yeah, not what? This. Coodchucks. Because they could be anything. Googly eyes. So you're just selling googly eyes. You sold off all your googly eyes, paid off Edith and Harold, and broke even? Yep. Aw, I'm proud of I mean, at least they course. fucking, you know, Mr. earned some of the money. Oh my what? god, a Why? B minus? That's a belch A. Oh. I saved two googly. Often they said B, I mean D minus. Down here. Hi. It's me. Oh my fucking <laughs> god. I know, I know, I know. You see? This is why we need a net from the ceiling. So when things like this happen, <laughs> Okay. Here's all the money I owe you. I just, I want to be able to come here as a real customer. Okay, then. You want to be a real customer. I'm tired of dashing, Bob. Can we start over? Sure. Unless this is uh, another fucking scam. Louise and Jean are going to duct tape your hands. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Turn, I don't even know what's happening, but I love it. Yep. Pay first. Push your wallet across the counter with your face. And don't talk while we make change. In fact, we're not even making change. It's all tip. Okay, then. I'll be fair enough. Okay, let's just go straight to the next one. What are you doing? Make it look scary. What? <laughs> what what's the, what's the difference between those positions? Mm, looks like an ugly ghost. Okay, then. We can on it. You know what? <laughs> oh my it's poor guy, I guess. Oh, okay. I love how Ocean Avenue is gonna be pedestrian only. Also, I love the fact that everyone else is having like big Halloween decorations except for their restaurant. I know I'm a little old to trick or treat, but damn, they gotta get me some sticky sugar booms. Sticky sugar booms? What is sticky yeah, sugar booms? Yeah, what? Booms? A new candy slash reason for living. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Hey, here's a flyer from your dentist. Dr. Yap is offering to pay you a dollar a pound for your Halloween candy. What the Why fuck? The hell would we do yeah, that? what? We work for that sugar girl. Plus, I mean, blind candy is oh, that would be a shit ton of money, though, to be fair. Hey, Teddy, how you doing? Good. I, I mean, okay, maybe, or maybe not. <laughs> what? What's going on? Yeah, what? Uh, well, you know that candle place next door? Those yes. Can. Dole. Horrible name. I don't even understand this. <laughs> yeah, well, they hired a handyman to set out their Halloween decorations. Oh, okay. And it wasn't you. 
Yup. His name is Glenn. The guy's okay. always beating me out for jobs. His oh, hook is, okay, is but... this smell nice handyman. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> not that. You're not that. Yeah, okay. You smell incredible yeah, all I'm, the time. To be honest, Teddy smelling a bit weed would not surprise me, to be honest. That's funny. I got hired next door at Bob's to decorate the front of their place for Halloween. Uh -huh, okay. You, yeah, there's literally no, no right, decorations. No, no. Right. Okay, so hear me out. If you let me, I'll do your decorations for free. Oh, okay. Okay, fine, Teddy. You can decorate the front of the restaurant if you want. Yay! Oh, thanks a lot. I mean, to be fair, that their restaurant is like the least oh, decorated ones out of them all. Along, Teddy. It's coming along wonderfully, Glenn. Thank you very much. How's your so-called bat? My bat is spectacular. Thanks for asking. Okay. I mean, this guy just seemed like a bit of a dick, dude. I want to see my babies in the costumes. We've been ready for five minutes. Oh. We're waiting for you. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Who are you trust as? Yes. I'm Andre 3000 the Giant. Okay, oh, then. Sure. So I don't know. Who or Jane? what that Who is. Are you, Louise? I'm a dragon with a girl tattoo. Ooh, <laughs> that's the script. What okay. And what are you, Tina? I'm none of your business. Okay. Jeez. <laughs> Wait. Again, that's a fucking genius ass costume. I got, I got it. What, what is it then? She's a nun. She's a cranky nun. What about the briefcase? Why? Well, that's why she's Yes, yeah, she's a nun she's that has a business. Again, okay, that's a fucking genius they costume. Got a cool costume. Yeah, yeah who is he to be? I'm working on here on Halloween night. I should probably blend in. I don't okay, want to look weird, then. Bob. Uh, I mean, I guess so. The decorations? Great. I'm almost done. Just because it's definitely not before also, Halloween anymore. Yeah, and also, you've been doing that for fucking hours. What could you possibly, you know, have changed? Hey, when you nail it, you nail it. Ah, what the crap. fuck? Okay, that's actually kind of fucking cool, though, to be that's fair. Amazing. Yeah, that is actually real. sick. That's better than real. Uh, that's better than bats. You want to see <laughs> move? No, it doesn't move at all. God, it's like something out of Da Vinci's sketchbook. Okay, then. I mean, like, that's a weak fucking cotton, like, you know, what's it called? Comparison for sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Jimmy Jr. Zeke. That's loud. Hey, Tina. So you're trick or treating, huh? Yep. We're not. You can say okay. we're more into the trick part this year. Ha! So what? <laughs> Just chucking whatever the yeah. fuck that is Missed on the ground. Oh, well, that yeah. one didn't explode, but you get the point. Is it one of those poppy popper things? I forgot what they're called. That you throw them and they like explode. You guys are idiots. I'm just <laughs> <eating> candy. <sighs> Who the fuck is this following them? Mayday! Is it Dr. Oh, yeah? Because, you know, no, of that dollar candy it. thing. Your candy got stolen by an actual devil? I guess it could have been a human in a devil costume. <laughs> I mean, yeah, obviously it is Halloween. Punk teens being punks. Sorry, guys. That really sucks. <sighs> hey, has it What the fuck happened to Rudy's world? Here? We have Astro not. Why? Because that astronaut stole my bag of candy. Okay, Jesus Christ. Why do I, I, why do I have a feeling it's Dr. Yap? Because he had that thing, a dollar per piece of candy. My candy oh my God, okay, it's everyone. Candy. Oh no, you too? Who took yours, a devil or an astronaut? Neither. It okay. was a hockey goalie with a knife. Oh, okay, well, I'm guessing it's not one person then. Guys, I really don't want my candy to get stolen. Should we drop ours off at home? No, no, no. Um, We'd be wasting I don't know, you maybe, maybe you could, but to be fair. Teens. I don't know, it might not be them. Ah! Gene, what happened? My candy is What gone. the f- How? <laughs> Who took it? That guy! No, that, that guy! I okay, I'm guessing the guy just ran up talking him. about him realizing. Yeah, man, those accusations stink. They're picking us off one by one. Okay. I'm dying. <laughs> oh, no, his eyes are yeah. really back in his head. Okay, yeah, come on. It's not, it's not that fucking, you know, deep. I mean, it is candy, though, to be fair. Here we go. Okay, to be fair, that's actually kind of cool. Look at it go! Plus, it's motion activated. Well, what the, what the hell? hell? That? Okay. Looks like a Ghost? Yeah. I'm projecting this ghost-like image onto a and, and These are just getting more and more impressive, Teddy. I feel like you're not going to be able to top this guy. Oh, it looks really real. Yep, it's a hell of an effect over here. I mean, why is it in the doorway? Unless people are going in there to trick or treat. Well, Teddy wasn't finished with his bike. Oh, yet. okay, he was shit. No, he has big plans still. Glenn. Oh god, like what? We know it's late, okay? <laughs> Glenn, never heard of a. I mean, to be fair though, that other guy's also still working on the shit when it is 8 30. Here we go. Okay. Go, go, we're going. go, Teddy, go. I don't know what else they could possibly add to that though, to be honest. That we're doing, that we definitely know what it is. <laughs> uh... 
got to rebuild one trick or treat at a time. Can we re trick or treat the place we've already trick or treated? I mean, Is probably not. Reasonable? Wait, you all got your candy stolen while you were on Ocean Avenue, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that means if we don't want our candy stolen. I mean, don't go to Ocean Avenue. Okay. Okay, we're all safe inside, and Tina and I still have our candy. Yeah. Job, For how long, dude? Oh, I, I'm still so curious to know, see who's stealing this because it's obviously multiple people, I'm guessing. Well, there goes Tina's. on my feet and whatnot. Good, sir. Thank you. Trick her. Oh, okay, sorry, well. I'm doing my bag. Doing my bag. Ooh, did you see who took it? No, yes, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, no, it's some guy. It's a fucking some sort of mask, obviously. I'm guessing. I mean, the fact that it was multiple different masks or whatever that apparently was they were being stolen from. All right. Good. <laughs> Bill's okay. Let's head towards home and get this. I mean, to be fair, though, at least you could Wait, probably see the person if they do a tip skill. Um, none, I think. Then who's that? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. There's a gorilla in our midst. Jesus Christ. The fact that they're on a skateboard and that, I, I'm, I, don't, I don't know who it could possibly be. My best guess is maybe Logan. Because I, I don't know, I find it weird that they said that they kept specifically targeting them. There, he's on that side street. <laughs> he's too fast, and I'm not just saying that as a slow boy. <laughs> the way you fucking describe that cheating. slow boy. Yeah, girls can't even ride those things, probably. Yeah, yeah, okay. Are, are they going to fucking catch the bus? Do they, do they even have any money? Bus driver, follow that gorilla. You got it. Hold on tight, kids. Okay. Does the bus even go the same way as what this guy is going? Surely there's like a set bus route. What the fuck? That was tough to watch. I mean, you root for him to fall off and then he falls off and then you don't know how to feel. Okay, where is he going? I have a route. Yeah, that's what I thought. Way too easily. Are you serious? This is an emergency. A candy emergency. You know what else is an emergency? Respecting myself. Yeah, okay. <laughs> At least it would be pretty easy to find him at this point. How's it going out here with the decorations he's still putting up for some reason? Yeah, hey, apparently. Oh, no, I wanted to dress up. How was okay. that dressing yeah, up? Yeah, what? I'm Bruce Springsteen. Bruce Who? Springsteen? Not really. Okay. I thought you were Rambo. No, I wouldn't just put on a bandana. <laughs> okay, sure. It just looks like Bob with a fucking bandana. Hey, what's on the spider's legs? Oh, those are chainsaws. What? what? Chainsaws? Are they gonna they're fucking turn ones, on? Right? No, they're real. Are they okay, then. The spider's legs? Well, not all of them. We could only get four chainsaws. Okay. Got a of legs that have where, where did you even get them from? I'm not explaining to the kids that their dad died in a chainsaw <laughs> spider accident. <laughs> yep. and yeah, that would be fucking the sh one of the dumbest feet. ways you know someone died. I know our arrangement. I'll be careful. Okay. okay. I, I think we're ready. I hope Glenn is still around. You should at least probably get down. Just in case you do fucking cut, it does cut your head off. Oh my god. <laughs> well, I guess that it took down the bat. Uh, I might just uh, stay out here and look for the astronaut and that devil um, and that Jason guy. Any suspicious hockey going, really? I'm gonna give Tina some backup. Okay, just fucking go in there. Surely you'd find it eventually. Can't be that scary. Normally these haunted houses aren't even actually that scary. <laughs> Candy back, but I also really want to leave. I mean, yeah, fair enough. Both of you stop it. There! He's going into okay. the ballroom. Okay, oh, jeez, that, that sounds fucking air. cheery. Any blood. I got a thing about that. Okay. So, how's I love how the fucking two. Actually, no, Daryl's like a year older than Gene. I was gonna say, I like how the, you know, the two older kids are the ones that are staying outside. Where'd he go? He's gotta be in here. <laughs> What the fuck? Okay, well, it is in there. I want to know who this is. My best guess is even like that Logan, or if it's Dr. Gap. Tina, Jean. Do we realize you might need us in here more than we needed to not be in here? Okay. Also, a guy came out and puked like 10 feet from us. <laughs> Ew. Great. You guys are yes. heroes. How'd you even see him in here? We tackled a lot of people before we tackled him. Wait, what? Oh. Cool. <laughs> okay, I was about to say. Who are you? I was fucking right. I knew it. Does that mean he was just constantly changing costumes? Why, Yap? Why would you steal our candy? I didn't want to. You left me no choice. Okay. Every year I send out my flyers with my very generous cash for candy offer, and every year it's ignored. Well, what do you expect? I feel like kids like, you know, candy and shit more than fucking money. And I mean, even if they had money, they could fucking buy candy themselves anyway. Where is it, dentist? Uh, let's just say your Halloween has been... Incinerated? What? He burned the fucking kid. Incinerator guy, stop! Stop incinerating! Okay, well, I guess that was a couple bits of kid. Don't burn that 
not candy! But I was told to burn the candy. Well, you've also been told to not burn the candy by us just now. Yes. So, makes you think? It's just How much of the candy that has been has been fucking burnt, though, so far? Burn the candy. Yes, burn the candy! Oh my god. Ah, you evil dadgas! You really feel good about burning kids' candy. Yes. Halloween. Like, that is yes, kind of insane. Wait, it's Halloween? It is. <laughs> what? What? How did you not know that? There's no singing. There aren't even cards. We dress as monsters and threaten people with tricks, and they give us candy. Yeah, that. What do you think? When you put it like that, Halloween's fucking on. You know it was Halloween already. <laughs> That's what being in a coma for six months will do. Oh, now. okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, can we have the candy? Yeah. <gasps> Yay! Yeah. But what about your teeth? They're gonna rot. Oh my god. Some of us have disposable teeth. Yeah, nothing's forever. Yeah. I mean, okay, except then. for my teeth. They're adult teeth. <laughs> but I have lots. No, no, you don't. Sometimes. Okay, barely. then. Yeah, pretty much barely. Oh, yes. I love the fucking heroic way they're walking. Oh, sorry. You okay? Here you go, kid. Stick this in your face hole. Here oh, hell yes. Yay, candy. Okay, okay. <laughs> candy for you. Candy for you. And here's some candy for you. So, you didn't make it to Mutilation Mansion? No, they apparently not. I went in Mutilation Mansion with like fourth graders, but cool. Yeah, that's what hey, I'm fucking tonight. funny that a bunch of like well, yeeple in your briefcase. Sweated None there. Of business. Get it? Just kidding, it's a crap load of oh, candy. Oh, hell yes. Oh, that's a lot of candy. Hot damn! Hallelujah! Y'all oh, got it! Come on. What is this music? I like it. It sounds so familiar. Get away! Oh, hey, <laughs> come uh, get your, uh, hey, oh yes. If I wanna put some sweet oh my god, is this a parody of that salt and pepper song? Yes. Bring sticky sugar booms up into a room. It's none of your business. Yes. If you this is fucking good though, this song. This, the fact that they did this is actually amazing though. Okay, I mean, we'll start with the first one. Oh my god, okay. The thing I found funny about that is that it pretty much shows every single thing that's wrong with businesses, like the executives and that. Do like jack shit. And then like all the, you know, laborers and all that and people actually you know having to bust their ass off the ones actually keeping this company afloat like the moment louise jean and rudy they started half assing it it just went to complete shit but like the fact that tina got convinced into being like you know a big executive woman or whatever that quickly is kind of funny i mean i guess the idea of doing absolutely jack shit is kind of funny but yeah like they could have at least brought them protective equipment so they don't have to inhale sawdust every five seconds like and the fact that they're like oh they're making them every 20 minutes you have five now which that that is so accurate though so many fucking places do that you know overwork their, their staff and that like it's insane and it was, it was pretty funny though tina just started doing the typical business person fucking jargon boring fucking word vomit or whatever i can't think of what to say but like the t stereotypical business person bullshit like she started spewing all that all that out which was kind of funny and the fact she, she was like this close to fucking scamming teddy as well was kind of funny but to be fair though the I jimmy jr's idea for the business wasn't necessarily terrible like it is out of school so a bunch of kids are just gonna buy something as stupid as a bit of wood with fucking googly eyes or and a smile drawn on it but the fact at the end they just straight up sold just the googly eyes was kind of funny because like i feel like that's a sh even like shittier than just a piece of wood with googly eyes on it you can literally just go to a craft store and buy it and you're pretty much fine no but the second episode that that was a good halloween episode i always love halloween episodes of show of shows like a lot more than christmas episodes that one was funny though tina's costume was fucking the was the greatest thing I've ever seen ever. At least the, the greatest Halloween costume I've ever seen. None of your business. I, I don't know why I find that so funny. But the, I fucking knew it must have been the dentist. But then when, when they started talking about, you know, that it was multiple people in different costumes and that, I was a little bit like, uh, maybe not. But of course he was changing costumes, but... I assumed it was him because from the moment they started saying that people were stealing their candy because like with the whole each piece of candy is equals a dollar thing, which that would be good money. But like, do you really expect a fucking kid to do that? In fact, if kids did that, they could probably go to the store and shops and shit and like buy more candy anyway. The fact that he was going to get this guy to incinerate it as well was also insane. Like, I understand wanting the kids to have like good dental hygiene and shit, but like, it's still... Kind of fucking insane. Like, let kids have fun. Like, they're not brushing their teeth and that. Blame the parents more than the kids at Halloween. I read that's also the fucking handyman off thing or whatever that Teddy was doing. It, it was funny, though. It was kind of, I don't know, somewhat wholesome at the end there when, the, when he, they found that the guy was, you know, trying to impress Teddy. 
because Teddy is apparently like the greatest fucking handyman around uh, this area, I guess. Those decorations, though, were kind of insane and kind of cool. I mean, the fucking chainsaw one that Teddy and Bob did at the end was a little bit like too far, but oh well. Anyway, I'm going to leave it here. I hope you enjoyed this. These were two good episodes. I enjoyed them. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.